having our pasta on and then we need to the mixture. Ben's is over here, isn't it? Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. channel welcome to the vlog so yeah as you can see we've had a delivery of our hello fresh box for some reason we got two boxes this week haven't we i couldn't get it all in one box i don't think mm. so because even though we still got five meals here for four of us um yeah like i said they put in two things obviously all the all the fridgey products have we, we've all had see we've already took them out haven't you yeah they arrived about half an hour ago so Cheryl said uh, put them in the fridge so uh, they're all loose in there aren't they? They are yeah so we thought because well, obviously I was So they came work. in there in normal hessian sacks with the ice packs in and took them out anyway. And you said nothing was damaged this week did you? No nope, nothing's damaged this week the boxes are in good nick the as you can tell. The boxes are quite stronger actually aren't they this time? Yeah the boxes are not damaged or nothing. So anyway yeah so obviously I'll show you all the meat products and stuff like that anyway but you can probably gather from what they are. So you understand what clue what meals they are this week have you? No I just dumped it all in the fridge. Um, because obviously Sam is like last week was all oh, can I choose the, the meal so Sam has actually chosen things as well so knowing Sam it could be anything you know. Yeah. So anyway yeah so obviously they do come in here again what have I got here actually? I've got what was this? One of my simple pleasures look at this. Hello on the marketplace. Look at that. Oh, that sounds nice, isn't it? Is that a new dessert or something? Yeah, it's gluten. Yeah, it's got, it's got it's gluten free and dairy free as well. Yeah, I just wish you know. I don't know if Hello Fresh do gluten free boxes, do they? I don't know, but the thing is, we do have to make sure some of the meals aren't gluten free, don't we? Yeah. What's this? Let's do lunch. You'll find stacks of toys on the expanded menu. Okay. If they do anything different around Christmas time. I wonder. What's this one here? Just loads of leaflets, look. <laughs> Pointless leaflets. Yeah. What's that? 50% off wild? A little magazine there, look. Is that Butlins on the back? Sandals. Oh, the Caribbean. They look like Butlins. They look like Butlins to you. That's nah, too posh for Butlins. Too posh for yes, too posh for <laughs> Butlins, look. Just things like that. So, Shall and I have a sneak with the camera, see what's in there? Yeah, look, what's in there? Yeah. Right then, you're going to pull the recipe cards out. I'll pull the recipe cards out. As before, we're not opening the pouches until we go One, to two, the One, two, three. So we've got three here to bash two recipe cards in here. So, right. Now, was, I mean, just typical, we've picked up a pasta dish. Herby, creamy, tomato, chicken, chicken pen. penne. Hmm? <laughs> he keeps picking it, he picked the same dishes as always, doesn't he? I know. I, know, I noticed that when I put all the fresh stuff in the fridge. I put all oh, mushrooms, bacon, chicken. <laughs> I thought, blooming hell, we might as well just go to Audi still. I know, but hmm. you know, we said, we did Ooh, say... Oh, that lasagna. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to recommend. But you did, we did say Sam could choose it. So yes, we've got a herby, creamy, tomato, chicken penne, which is number one, which is that one just there. So is it going to be a guessing game what's for tonight then? I reckon so. So we've got that one. It's my turn to choose tonight. It is. Um, it's picked <coughs> Herbie, Harissa cauliflower, mushroom and lentil pie. It's oh, picked that so up. that's why all that cauliflower then. Yeah. Mm. So I'll tell you what, it's pretty good actually because of the pasta dish you can can't have but you can have this one. Which is pretty good. You can have the pasta dish, you can replace it with his I'll own pasta. Replace it with his own pasta, which is fine, you can do mm. that one. Um, it's also picked some crispy, oh sorry, that one there was number 20, which was that one on there as well. <laughs> I can see some sort of pasta type thing there on that one. What do you think we're carrots in this week? Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> play the carrots on that one. And he's also picked this one, crispy onion top barbecue hot dogs. Oh, that looks different. That sounds quite nice, doesn't it? Mm. And also in here you've got two packets of the brioche hot dog bun things. Are they for that recipe? They're, these are for this recipe mm. here as well. So if I put them back in there for a minute. Put them back in there. And then in this box, this is has got all the freshy bits in here as well. So we have, um, they're the hickory smoked barbecue sausages. How many have we got in there? And you've got four in there. Can Ben have these? Yeah, Ben can have these as well, which is good. They're not, um, we've got blue gluten free, that's good. Ben can have those. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Five packets of mushrooms. That's five recipes though, isn't it? That's five recipes. So there's like each recipe we're going to have Blimey, mushrooms. if all that lot was in one recipe. Yeah. So we're going to have five. So there's like each of our recipes we've got this week. We've got mushrooms. We've got mm. one, two packets. Yeah. We've got two lots of chicken. Yeah. Um, one, two, two lots of normal cheese. One, two... Three lots Jeez, of... You've still got some of those left over from the last box. What I are they for have, then? I must have been for a recipe and this up. So you've got three lots of cheese as well. Yeah. Because some, actually some of the recipes want some of that and a bit of that. Alright. Oh, so okay. probably, maybe I did put that on. I, maybe, I think last time I did put that in because there was enough cheese with the other one in. So you've got a packet of the um, coleslaw. That's much less for our hot dogs. Yeah. There, so a packet of those. Mm. So we've probably got two packets of those. Yeah. Um, a garlic. <laughs> this time make sure we don't use a whole garlic up, garlic up in one go. There is two garlics in there because I saw it. Oh, is there? Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's a big packet of cauliflower. You make cauliflower cheese. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What's that? What's looking on there? You can't find it. So he was looking for a macaroni cheese. Mm. So you've got one, two, three packets of creme fraiche. Yeah, none of them burst this time. None of them burst this time, which is <laughs> great. Yeah. Um, speaking, oh. of, speaking of bursting, did they ever do anything about those ones that had a problem last week? No, they never got back to me. It was only a little tiny mini, but I think it was Shader's fault, to be honest with you. Mm. Um, two more packets of chicken. Yeah. Love our chicken, don't we? Hey, we let Sammy pick the meal, so if we don't like him, it's Sammy's fault. Nothing Sammy's wrong with fault. chicken. No. Um, bacon. Oh. Lardons. Two, got two packets of bacon lardons. Yeah. That's garlic again. The other garlic. Mm. And so then the other recipes he's picked are. <laughs> presto. Hey, presto. <laughs> presto bacon and mushroom linguine. Again, oh, another that, pasta dish. That might be on my radar for tonight. So, so far he's picked two pasta dishes. Mm, yeah? so I might do that one tonight. Or this one, or he's also picked this one. Creamy mushroom, chicken and mushrooms. Yeah. So yeah, so then you can see that one there is number 30, 39 on our list, which is that one just there. Mm. And then obviously the creamy mustard, chicken and mushrooms is number 19, which is this packet just there. There. There we go. You are? Creamy mushroom and chicken and mac. Oh, that sounds nice. What's that? This one's got potatoes with it again. Yeah. So you are. This um, one only takes 20 minutes to cook, right? Wait, are you happy with sandwich choices this week? Yeah. Herby creamy chicken pe pe pasta penne, like herty curhurisa cauliflower mushroom and lentils, crispy chicken. Crispy onion top barbecue hot dogs, creamy mustard and mustard chicken and mushrooms, and then presto bacon and mushroom linguine. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Well, look at that. Which one? That mushroom. That mushroom linguine one for tonight. Oh, that one. Yeah. We can do actually because don't forget Ben's got his own pasta, his own sketty in there. Look, 25, 25 minutes. Five minutes. It's customer favourite apparently. Mm hmm. The linguine which we've got. Um, Sliced mushrooms, yeah, garlic. So think, oh, that's got broccoli at this time. The broccoli must be in the bag then, Must yeah. be in the bag. Anything we need from the pantry on this one? 
What's it say from the pantry? This water, I think this is uh, pasta water. Pasta water's made by the pasta. Uh, no, it's exactly, yes, I say it is, yeah. So, like I said, where, where, do you think, where do you think the water's going to come from? You know what I mean. <laughs> Mm. So if you want that one, that's fine because Ben's got his own skate. You can have his own skate. We can must do that one. Or if you fancy that one, like I said, it's your choice. Yeah, if, if, if it's got carrots in it, I think I fancy a break from carrots at the minute. Well, this one hasn't got carrots, and this has got broccoli, and this has got cauliflower in it, and cauliflower and mushrooms in this one. I think we had carrots every day this week. I wonder why my eyes feel like they've seen in the dark. <laughs> Actually, I don't think Sam is. No, Sam doesn't. Would you believe Sam has picked no recipes? I've got carrots in them this week. Oh well, are you uh, sort it out next week's box. Not yet, no. No. You sort on next week's box and go for my. Are you going to go on there and have a look, see what's coming next? Mate? I will, that's what's coming next year. So, anyway, yeah. That's yeah, so our uh, for the that's week. our low fresh box for this week. So, later on, we'll, we'll uh, decide what we're having for tea first and let's even cook it. It's my turn. I'll decide tonight. It's my turn. You sure tend to cook tonight, yeah. isn't it? I'm quite enjoying doing these because it's just everything that's in one of those bags is just enough for four of us. It and is. Especially afterwards, no one else is picking anything else. I know Sammy has his ice cream, but I mean like snacky bits, you know. I know. Yeah. We, we did look at the Grosse boxes as well, didn't we? They look so nice. Well, I'm not having them at all. No. It's either this one or that one. Yeah, I know. So we wait till all of our discount codes end. Yeah. I think we've got about six weeks worth of discount codes. See how much your full price is. If not, then we might go, go back over to Gusco for a little bit and sip sip was our favourite and stick from there. Right, so you're going to put all that fresh stuff back in the fridge? I'll put the fresh stuff back in the fridge and, and then, then we'll sort this out. Yeah. Right, um, come join me now as I cook. do one of these meals. Whatever we want to cook. And this camera is charging up, so we'll see you in a bit. Right then, we've all decided that meal number one this week is going to be this one. Presto, 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 hey presto. Presto bacon and mushroom linguine. That looks very, very nice. So, in the bag we should have the linguine. The mushrooms are in the fridge. The bacon's in the fridge. Garlic's in the fridge. The broccoli should be in the bag. Crumb fresh is in the fridge. The stock price should be in the bag and the grated cheese should be in the fridge as well so let's get everything together and uh, see what we need so yes yeah, so Stephen's just going through right all then, the... I've got everything on here garlic yeah. cheese and fresh yeah lardons mushrooms what's in the bag yeah and that's Ben's replacement for what's in there yes it yeah and yeah so on here you can see you got all the amounts you need, which has come all ready prepared in the thing. So it says on here I need 120 grams of British lardon. So that's two of these, which are at 60 grams each. Yeah, that's it, yeah. The mushrooms were 120 grams. So there's one specific pack that was 120 grams. 120 grams. Oh, that's good. And then it was two creme fraiches. Yep. That were 300 grams, so that's 250s. Yeah. And then hard cheese was 40 grams, so that's just the one bag. Yeah, and so how many cloves of garlic do you need? Just two cloves, not the whole thing. <laughs> no, not the whole thing, so. Right, first job on here, as you can see, is cook the pasta. Boil, boil a full kettle, so I need to fill this up. Uh -huh. That's crazy, you need to, it's about boiling the kettle. That's the cheap way of doing it, isn't it? Right, just do it, it says. Yeah. Hello, fresh is the boss. So, anyway, yours, while Stephen's doing that, I'm just going to open up our bag. Here we go. So, in our bag, we have. What's this stuff? Oh, this is our. This is our broccoli in there. That's that tender skin broccoli. Yeah, got two lots of that, which isn't, which isn't too bad actually, so to be honest. Thing inside, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, and look, look at these little packets of pasta. Huh? You telling me that is no? I can say you can't tell me that's one portion. That is actually two portion, four portions, four portions, yeah. four portions of pasta. Sheet tells you how much it is. Yeah, but like I said, probably could have a little bit extra because obviously, like I said, Ben's got his own here as well. So, and also in here we have our vegetable stock cube um, pasting normally we have um 
normally don't with chicken, but we've got vegetable on this time. Mm. And we've got two of those, which isn't too bad. But anyway, do you want to cook Ben's the old fashioned way? Mm. Yeah, mm. you're cooking Ben's the old fashioned way with, because on Ben's it says here to actually boil in water. So, and wait for that to boil. Wait for that to boil and then put Ben's in for and him. And I'm sure we'll come back in a minute and watch we cook do it. Yeah. Right then, we have the lardons and we've got garlic here to peel as well. And then the next thing to do on the sheet is when we start doing the pasta, we've got to heat oil, which is just there. And then in the large frying pan, we're going to add the mushrooms alongside the bacon. So come back with me once all this starts to bubble. See what I mean by they say on the instructions about boil a full kettle, pour the boiled water into a large saucepan with half a table of high seat, and then add the pasta and bring back to the boil. So what is the point of boiling a kettle, bringing it here, and look, <laughs> it's still not bubbling. So you might as well have just filled that up with water in the first place and just let it bubble anyway. So, so that's not very good that one. Right, next one after this is it says if the camera's going to focus on it. Well, anyway, I'll just read it to you. Meanwhile, peel and grate the garlic for use or garlic press here. Half to ten stem broccoli, widthways. Right, so we'll come back in a minute once this is all all up and running. Right then, as you can see, we've got Ben's alternative pasta in there, steaming the camera as it's doing it. And we've got the linguine that came with the box, which is in there. And now the frying pan's heating up, so we need to uh, I need to ask Cheryl for help while I add the lardons and the bacon. So what have you got me to what do you want me to do? I want you to hold the camera. Okay, you hold the camera. You do your cooking. You be your chef in the making, yeah? So add your mushrooms. Mushrooms in. Yeah. Sizzle, 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 sizzle. Go on. You can hear that sizzling, can't you? Mm. That's it. Right. It's good that I wasn't one wasn't one thing on WhatsApp about hello. Did you get me the little uh, wooden spoon? Want the wooden spoon up the drawer? Mm. There we go. One thing I will say about Hello Fresh, it's nice because everything is individually on portion of control size, isn't it? Yeah, but it does say you can add extra if you want to. Yeah, probably well, we'll a bit extra bacon to this. Who in the house likes bacon? All of us. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter, Ben? What's the matter? You rubbing your tummy? You getting a hungry tummy? Right, of can you can you got that smell going up your nose? Meanwhile, peel and grate the garlic to be used in the garlic press after the garlic to the garlic. Yeah. And got a garlic press. Maybe we could get a garlic press, you know. Mm. Remember, only use the correct one this time. Yeah, we've well, got two cloves of garlic. I know we have. Sizzle, 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 sizzle. So while I'm peeling this, uh, we can come back in just a minute. Okay, wait for him to peel that first. Right, so what are we doing with the broccoli now? Basically, it says halve it. It's okay, so that'll probably be Half about... Half the broccoli, just halve it, just cut it out. Okay. Mm. Oh, right, okay. Mm. I suppose buying a broccoli like that, I suppose it saves the hassle then, doesn't it? Buying like the other ones we're having to, um, when we buy it from, when we buy it from Aldi, doesn't it? We're rubbish so, in the bin. We're rubbish in the bin, that's it, yep. Yeah. So over here, yeah, we've got our creme fraiche, our cheese, and then obviously I don't know what, what we need to do with our stock paste, you know? We'll find out in a minute. Find out in a minute, so. But anyway, yes, it smells really nice in our kitchen again at the minute, doesn't it? Mm. That's it, so you've got your bacon cook bacon and mushrooms cooking in there nicely. Oh, there you go, look. Scratch that. it, sniff it. it. <laughs> the rest is mine. <laughs> That's it, chop, them, chop all your broccoli up. That's it. Mm. Oh, 
That's it. No chocolate anymore. It only, if it only says half it, oh, it's only half it. Can't wash it under the sink. It did say it did say you need to wash it because it said it's already washed. But I'll wash it anyway. You wash it anyway, yeah. Um, I think we'll put the extractor fan on actually because you can see it's Steam getting up. it's getting steamy in here actually. So put that on as well up there. So yeah, that's an issue with this extractor fan. It's in the wrong place. And there, it's hopping by the gate. It then washes it now. That's it. Give that a wash. So what we've got to do with your garlic? Okay. That's a lot of cooking noise nice here, yeah. Wash those washing up in the sink. What do we do have to do now? Once the mushrooms and bacon are golden, stir in the garlic and cook for 30 seconds so that we wait for this to basically look like it's cooked. Okay, look for quite some quite quick yet though, is it? Give a couple more, give it a couple more minutes, I'll say. Mm. You can see the mushrooms have started to cook. That's how this is doing. That's doing right, isn't it? Mm. That's ours. Mm. And then let's get the other one out for Ben's actually. What's the hell's Ben's getting on? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Ben's getting on right actually, he's not the girl, so. Well what we're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to get his bowl out. Yeah. And then I can put a bit of this. In Ben's bowl. Well before I add that to that. Exactly, yeah. yeah. We'll do that. Right, the next step is to add the broccoli, as you can see, in with the pasta. As you can see, I've done some into our pot and some into Ben's. So if Cheryl holds the camera now, I'll add the garlic into that. That's it, good, that's it. Just put a little bit of time when you're a bit into Ben. Oh no, so what's that going there? I'm going there. Okay. I thought that was right for a set. That is quite an easy one actually, to be honest, isn't it? You do the dishwasher. Yeah. That's it. Right, next thing on here is to stir all this together. That's it, and then get Ben's. We're going for Ben as well. I never thought about adding broccoli to pasta, you know? Yeah. Just like when we had the spinach last week, you know, mm. and then we also had the, um, what did we have? We had the carrots and the apple, didn't we, yesterday? Yeah. And that was, that was different, you know? Right, it says on here, when the pasta has four minutes left, add the broccoli to the same pan. So I think that, that's about right now. That's about right now, yeah. Right, once the pasta and broccoli are cooked, reserve some of the pasta water. Yeah. See pantry amount, so I've got to reserve 200 mils of that. Okay. And then I'm going to and then drain in a colander, drizzle with oil, and stir through to prevent it sticking. Okay. Mm. Yeah. And then stir the reserved pasta water, creme fraiche, and vegetable stock paste into the mushrooms and bacon. So everything's going to go. Everything's going to go back into there. Yeah. Okay. And then add the cooked pasta, broccoli, and hard Italian style cheese to the sauce and gently tossed the coat, so everything's got to go in the wine. Oh, okay, that's an idea actually, isn't yeah. it? And then add another splash of water if the sauce is a bit thick. Look, if that's the case, do you want to get out the, the, you get out the small little frying pan? Is that the small frying pan? That's a big one. That's what's, a small one there. What's the small one? Button? So get that out for, I'll tell you what, if you've got our water to it, add this, get this one out for him actually. Get, the, get that one out for Ben's, put a bit of Ben's in there. What's the room on it? Oh no, it's going to have to be in after all then, isn't it? Mm. That's the only problem that's, that's, that's about it. That's the only problem with the kitchen fresh. Hands are stuck in you though, isn't it, as well? Oh, well, at least they get used. They do, yeah, they are getting used actually. You're just going to have to wait until one of these comes exactly, off. Exactly, you have to wait until one of them come off anyway. So at least you've got the little frying pan there so we don't get bends or mix up, especially with filming all the pasta and stuff. We don't get no cross contamination and nothing like that, do we? So, yeah, tell you what, that's cooking really nicely actually, isn't it? I'm going to have to get a walk. If we're going to continue to have these, I'm going to need a walk. I had well, I can imagine what that's going to look like in a minute when it's got it all in. It's going to be like a beer. Yeah. I can remember when I lived at home I had to walk and I didn't use it, so I got rid of it. Yeah. You know?
Right, so what do we do well, now? I've drained off some pasta water, as it says there. Yeah. Now basically it's just basically. Okay. okay. That's all right, yeah. That's good. So is that one, that was for hours, isn't it, that one? That's it, yeah. The next one I need to drain bends. Two bends, that's it. Till what it gets, it certainly gets hot in here, doesn't it? So yeah, so how much pasta water did you keep for Ben? Yeah. How much pasta water did you keep for Ben? Same enough. Yeah. Take the same for that one as well, which is good. Um that's it, yeah? I forgot Ben's pasta in there as well, which is good. Yeah. Right, next thing now is to get this going again. Okay. Right. Okay, I've done that. Uh, so I've put a bit of oil in there. Okay. To prevent sticking. Alright, okay. Mm. That's it. Yeah. And Ben's there as well. Nice and warm. Pull it up. That's there. Uh, what I need to do is take Grab. some of that out. That's it for bed. That's it. That's that's plenty for us, isn't that? That's it, yeah. Tell you what, you can see you smell that garlic, can't you? What's what's to do now? Hold on, I'll tell you what. I'll change my mind. Let's put that all back in there. Yeah. Because before I'm going to add all the other stuff to it. Oh, I've got to add the other oh, stuff to it first. Before you add the pasta back. Oh, right, okay. So you might as well then just do it that way then. Yeah, let's just do this first. You might as well then. Well, let's go. Let's add, stir in the reserved pasta water. Okay. Let's do that. Well, I'll put that, okay, that's fine, yeah. Next thing, add the creme fraiche. Okay. This time I've got scissors. Yeah. We went out earlier on and we did not get, we've only gone down to one pair of scissors. We went out earlier on, we did not get any scissors at all. Here we go. That's it. We're breaking news, you've just come through on your phone. That's it. I know. I'm trying to keep yourself into a little messy area where so everything goes to one plate. Oh yeah. And uh, next one. And then again. I've ever had creme fraiche until we start doing that. I haven't actually. I know one of our other recipes we've got, it's got, it's got peppers in it. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't even know how to appear on top of a pepper. One of the red stock bags, which is this. Okay. for a bit so we'll show you what that's like when it's all cooked in a second. Yes, we're just adding our pasta on I and mean, we need to the mixture. Ben's is over here isn't it? Yeah. And his little saucepan over there so yeah. So what do we need to do now then Dan? Uh, me some grate me some of these little blocks. Yeah. Put one in Ben's. Yeah. And then the other one can go on top of ours. Okay I can do that yeah. Yeah um, look at this. Look at that doesn't that look nice? Chop some of these big stalks. Huh? I would actually. Oh, that looks really nice. What? See what I mean by I need a walk. You do need a walk. Let's see if I get one actually. Anyone wants to buy me a walk for Christmas, it'd be much appreciated. Yeah. 
Chef Stephen wants a walk. <laughs> Yeah. But yeah, look at that, and that the bus. Then basically all you need to do is just put the cheese on it and then we're done. Yeah, so I need to add this pack Oh yeah. So you go and grate some of that with the greens. I will do. Find, where's the grater? What? Where's the grater? Here it is, I found the grater. The grater's there, so I add that onto Ben's and yeah? Yeah. Okay, then do that. There you go, dinner is served. Like I said, this is our bacon and mushroom um, linguine. Well, obviously you can see you've got like with the broccoli and there as well. Yeah, Stephen's just grating the last of the cheese over there. Do you want any? I've just well. used it all. Oh, doesn't matter if I don't want any anyway. It's only a little block. I know, that's a problem. Yeah. <laughs> Probably that's how that's what that we're actually supposed to serve four people. There is yes. some more in there. I know there is. Go on then, sweetheart. You want your dinner? Yeah? Go on then, sweetheart. Yeah. Go on then. You want your dinner? You're getting hungry. You're getting a hungry little boy. So you are saying please. And then ready. And then sit down. So yeah, so anyway, Sammy, how is that? There we go. Is that really, really nice, is it? Sit down and see hat. Sit down then, Ben. What's that right then, my sweetheart? Mm, is that nice? Sit down. Sit in the chair. Right then, it's the next day now, and uh, Cheryl's cooked the next Hello Fresh box, as you can see. Hello Fresh box. She hasn't cooked the whole box. I mean, I cooked the next Hello Fresh mm -hmm. recipe. <laughs> cooked the hell yeah, cooked the Hello Fresh. Yeah, you've had about five, um, fifteen. You've had about thirty meals all in one go. Right, which one you cooked tonight then? I cooked the hearty mm -hmm. harissa cauliflower mushroom and lentil pie. Oh, it's going to focus. Yeah, this camera's really bad at focusing anyway, that looks nice. You know, it doesn't look like the picture though, does it? Oh, more, you've made the mask look funny anyway, but otherwise it's the same. Look at Stephen though, it looks nicer, yeah. doesn't it? So, the only thing I haven't done is I haven't added the um, spice, the chamomile spice mix. I thought that, because that's quite um, spicy, that one is. Look. What it's did you do with that? That's gone in the bin, the spice bit has, but apart from that I've used everything yeah, well, else. The idea is, is to use everything instead of binning it, don't I? I know, the only thing I've done was the spice, because unless I haven't put, put my, my bit spicy. But apart from that I've done everything else. Okay. So, but yeah. Alright then, so that brings today's vlog to an end. So that's been a double day for you. Like the video, mm. comment down below, hit the subscribe button. See you in the next one. Bye everybody.